Call of Duty Black Ops 5 is the confirmed title, I believe, for this year's Call of Duty. Now let's not kid ourselves, we haven't had a COD that stood out in the last five years since the release of Black Ops 3. Every year, we follow the same pattern of getting excited in May and June after seeing all the trailers for the new installment. Then once the game actually comes out, we play it. I'll let you guys know that right now, I am in the mindset of just absolutely grinding Modern Warfare. And enjoy it for an extremely short period of time. We find all the problems with the game. What are you claymores there are? More than half of my deaths in this lobby are from claymores. Complain about them, stop playing, and then we wait until the next COD game comes out and hope it will be better. For example, when the current Call of Duty Modern Warfare came out, I was really enjoying it, as I thought the gun sounds and animations were brilliant, the new game modes like 2v2 Gunfight were extremely fun, and the new cross-platform play was an amazing way to unite all of us in the COD community. Then we started realizing the issues with the games. Terrible maps, nope. sniper shotguns, and I have to say this three times to add emphasis, campers, campers, and more campers. <laughs> While playing the game during a release week, I was having a blast, but once these issues came to be transparent, and these are some serious issues, the game to me got very stale, and after just one month of playing, I decided to stop, and haven't touched it since. This is the problem that Call of Duty has been having for multiple years. I stayed with Infinite Warfare for a while, but eventually left during the season because the game simply got old. Fortnite came out during COD World War II, which took us all away from that game mid-season, and Black Ops 4. Well, Black Ops 4 is a game that I thought had so much more potential, but in the end proved to be the same as those before it. A terrible installment with serious issues that Treyarch never bothered to fix. But hey, we can get into all that in another video. Regardless, for 4 straight years now, we have failed to receive a COD with a replayability value even close to that of the greats like Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3, or MW2, or MW3. Everything has fallen short. But wait, what about this year's COD? Is there any hope? And this, my friends? This is why we should get excited. My excitement comes from this. I have absolutely no expectations whatsoever for Black Ops 5. I have no idea where they are going to take their campaign, multiplayer, and zombies. I, I think we're getting zombies. But nevertheless, this sense of uncertainty has me extremely excited, as I know that now Treyarch can start fresh. They can do whatever they want with their campaign, multiplayer, and zombies. And this is the complete opposite approach I had to the release of Black Ops 4. When Black Ops 4 was coming out, we all had huge expectations for it to meet the bar set by its predecessor. We wanted a zombies experience that could somehow top the near perfect mode we got in Black Ops 3. We wanted a game that would one up the multiplayer, which to me was one of the best. We wanted a game that would beat the campaign. Uh, well, I don't really play campaign, so I don't really care about that. But nevertheless, we had all these huge expectations for Black Ops 4. And when it completely failed to reach any of them, we were extremely disappointed. The great thing about Black Ops 5, and the reason why I'm so excited for release day, is the fact that I have no expectations for this game. I have nothing to expect from their zombies and multiplayer, as Black Ops 4 set the bar so low it would be impossible to make something worse. <laughs> Black Ops 4 wrapped up our zombie storyline, failed to have a campaign, and brought us a multiplayer that was pay to win, and a complete Command C, Command B from BL3. All these things were so bad, but we're past them now, and onto a new chapter. So what will Black Ops 5 bring? I think it has the potential to bring something new, innovative, and exciting. And let me say, with Treyarch in charge of this game, I can't wait to see where it goes. So let's get hyped. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed or hyped, leave a like, subscribe if you want, and this might be the last COD I get, so I'm really hoping it'll be enjoyable. Thank you all. Peace out.